So we all know about Jake Paul versus Mike Tyson. This event will most likely be the biggest boxing event of 2024 and it's going to be hard to beat. The main event is huge with both guys being huge names in the sport and in the world. We have the influencer turned boxer Jake Paul who always has his eyes on his fights and has pretty much turned into a popular boxer at this point by having people want him to lose and hating on him. His opponent is Mike Tyson, one of boxing's greatest and I'm sure if you ask anyone in the world who Mike Tyson is, they'll know. The Komen event for this card features Amanda Serrano and Katie Taylor in their much anticipated rematch. This is huge for women's boxing and one of the biggest fights in women's boxing as of right now. But two more fights just got announced for the undercard which are huge. The first one is former UFC fighter Darren Till taking on Julio Cesar Chavez Jr, son of one of the greatest boxers to live. This will be a fun fight and Darren Till always brings the heat in the build ups and to the fight so I'm sure we're going to see that a lot which is going to be cool to see. But there is one more fight that was announced that is absolutely mind blowing. Usually boxing prospects take their time building their way up throughout the ranks starting out with lower class opponents and then gradually building up the competition as time goes on, but not this fight. We have Ashton H2O Silve who was signed to Jake Paul's promotion and then Floyd Kid Austin Schofield who have just announced that they will be fighting each other on the undercard of Jake Paul versus Mike Tyson. This is absolutely insane as these two are putting everything on the line so early into their careers. Most boxers love to keep that zero off their record and strategically pick opponents to keep that but these two don't care and are doing what the sport of boxing needs. Ashton Silve is only 20 years old sitting with the current pro record of a 11 wins and 9 of those wins coming by way of knockout. Schofield is 21 years old and sits at a record of 17-0 with 12 knockouts on his record. These two have just started their exciting careers and are now in one of the toughest fights in their careers. These guys are studs and have so much ahead of them yet they choose to fight each other and put it all on the line. The UFC has something where guys pretty much don't have a choice to who they have to fight and they just fight whoever they're given and can't really deny it. But boxing struggles with this because there's multiple belts, multiple promotions, and the many more complications that make it way more difficult for these guys to fight each other. But these two young stars are taking that step to making boxing a better sport. They're doing what we need and making these things great for the sport. Both have the talents to be future world champions and this fight will only make them stronger no matter who wins or who loses. One thing is for sure is that both these guys have huge balls and this takes a lot to do at this young stage in your career. Let me know in the comments who you guys think is going to win as this fight is a toss up between these two. They're obviously both really good and great prospects so it's going to be hard to pick but we'll have to find out on fight night. So make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.